In Sertorombos, you do get to see that green light very quickly. Just getting near the lights already seems to turn them green for you. How can this be? It is because there are detection loops well ahead of the intersections. Cyclists are detected early, so the lights can change for them. The first loop is at 25 meters. If the traffic situation allows it, you will have a green light before you even reach the second loop. You can get green so quickly because phases are kept as short as possible. If there is only one vehicle, the green time is just 4 seconds. Not only for a car, but also for a cyclist. If more vehicles were detected, the light stays green longer. Just long enough to let the last vehicle pass through the yellow light. If necessary and possible, the green time can be very long indeed, also for cycling. Buses directly influence the lights. When they are on time or running late, they get a green light as quickly as possible. If they are too early, even buses have to wait. The quicker the cars start, the quicker the junction is clear again, which means shorter waiting times for cycling.